Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi my name is Maureen. As you can tell by the title of this video, I have an exciting little Bottega Veneta haul for you guys. I'm doing a little unboxing. I just came back from Palm Beach this week. I did some shopping over there after doing a few meetings, which were very exciting, which I'll of course be telling you about in the future. But we did a little shopping. We went over to Worth Avenue. I have been eyeing some navy bags that I wanted to take a look at. I wanted to see the color in person. It was kind of between two bags that I didn't know actually if I was gonna buy this bag that I bought until I saw it in person. So I always recommend when you're buying bags, get the fun experience of being in the store and see them in person to see what you like. I was looking specifically for navy, so they're calling it the Duke color at Bottega Veneta. So I was originally gonna look at the small Adiamo bag. So if I can find a picture, I'll try to put it in, but if I can't, I'll just try to like link it down below for you guys so you can see. I liked it, but to me it just felt a little small. I knew I wasn't going to get everything in there, like my wallet, my phone, keys, and then if I'm taking my camera along as well to vlog, it just wasn't all going to fit. So they also had something different in store because I was gonna have to order that one because they didn't have it in that color. So I was able to get a different bag that I saw in person and I'm going to show you guys what it is. So this is the little sleeve that it comes in, the little Bottega Veneta. So I always recommend getting these dust bags. Sometimes they'll ask if you want it or not. I always recommend having it, having gone through Hurricane Ian and plenty of storms since then. It's really important that you have a dust bag if you're leaving your bags behind. So this will keep them protected from any sort of like flood, molding, things like that. Because otherwise, if they're not in those, they may not survive. So that is something to keep in mind. So let's just open it up. So here is what it looks like. This is the Teen Loren 1980s bag. I'll have the proper name and everything on the screen and linked down below as well if that's something you're interested in. So immediately when I saw it, I was like, wow, this looks like a 1980s bag. Just a, like a fun little shape and it's based off of a movie. I guess there was something like this in a movie so they kind of inspired this bag that they made. So like I said, in that Duke navy color, I do not have any navy purses. I did pre-Hurricane Ian, so decided to purchase a navy bag because I have lots of navies and blues and blue shoes, navy shoes to wear. So very excited about this. Here's how you open it. So I liked that aspect. I like that it's not like open for someone to put their hands in, etc. It just gives you a little bit more like privacy and security. And then from there, I just liked how roomy it was on the inside. I do have some little like paper in here to keep the size, but definitely a lot bigger on the inside than the small Adiamo and around the same price, a little bit less as well. And so I just liked that aspect too, but I can hold so much in there. There's also a chain if you decide to wear it like that on, which I can show you guys as well, or you can keep it tucked in and kind of wear it like as a clutch if you wanted. So that's really nice. I liked the size and how it looked when I was carrying it. You always wanna see how it looks on your body and your frame too which I loved this, so let me show you guys. So this is what it looks like on the side. I really liked that. Just looks really nice and not too overbearing, but still has plenty of room for all of your items. So that is everything from this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love my Bottega Veneta bags. Please like this video, comment down below if you have anything from Bottega Veneta or if you're going to be purchasing something from there, I would love to know and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on my, any of my content. Also, if you're wanting to see the shopping vlog where I picked this bag up, I will have that link down below and then up above as well. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone. Hanging around after last orders. We're still so far from home.